Yeesh. I don't think I've ever been in the reach before. Really? Mm -hmm. Usually I... If I'm heading from... Why did... <laughs> oh. Hey, Cayman. Yeah. I know you're a Bosmer and all that, but... Are you also an alchemist? Uh... Ish. I just picked a flower just now. Would you like it? Keep it. No offense, I just... Green packed. Right here. I, I thought the green pack forbids Bosma from, you know, picking or damaging plants. Yes. And using them. Oh. Mammoth. But yeah, whenever I go to Solitude from Whiterun, I usually go up by way of uh, Rorkstead. Rather than through here. Pay attention. Yeesh. This feels like... Feels like you're being watched, huh? A little bit, yeah. If you're up high on one of these places, hello. Well, we're not going... ...that way. We are going that way. Uh, of course. Okay, well, this'll be fun. Jeez. Sneaky Bosma. Force one. Oh yeah. Dead. Careful. Done and done. Sorry, I didn't want to cast a rune under your feet. Eh, it's fine. Yikes. And it's- it's not fine. I'd rather not burn you at all, you know. Just seems kind of rude. Okay, this looks not promising. It looked promising, but it's not. Um, yes, actually. Uh, we're gonna go this way. The map is not the territory and all that, but um... Yeesh. This place is crawling with false one in it. Yes, it is. So keep your guard up. False one and whoever this is. A storm cloak. What in oblivion are storm cloaks doing out in the reach? I thought this place was controlled by the Imperials. By the Legion, I should say. Beats me. Okay, Darkfall Cave is gonna be somewhere in that general direction. Hello, giant mud crab. At least I think it is. Oh yeah. Fun.
They'll find their own way around. Oh, good. With any luck, they'll find their way around that doesn't require... ...getting... <sighs> ...submerged in a river. Immersed in a river. I can't jump. Imperials can't jump. Or something. Where did they both run off to? There's Serana. I'm gonna guess there's no way I'm gonna be able to see. No, no way. He blends. Do you have any idea where he went? Oh, there he is. He blends, but not much. Not when he's moving, anyway. Goats. Don't you even think about it. Let's see if your blood has any power to it. What? Oh! Anyone else? Oh, yeah. Got him. Wow. I- I am. Strange, I- Hmm. Better than the flame cloak, I'd say. Still a little bit Odd. I'm not usually an ice-ish style mage. Orcish hatchet. Would you like a hatchet? Nope, I'm thinking I'm gonna stick with my Dawnguard axe for now. Especially if we're gonna be going up against more vampires. That's fair. We don't know what we're gonna be up against, but uh... Probably smart. Pale shadow. I know, like, maybe two illusion spells. I'm taking that, thank you. I will give you this arrow. Actually, you probably... You probably shot this arrow. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just gonna give you all of the random arrows that I'm carrying, actually. That'll work. You're still carrying around that crossbow? Yeah, haven't I'm used no it. Fan of the sun. It would be better than this. Mm-hmm. Uh, right. I have gotten lost again. Eh, find my way up through there somewhere. Eventually. Oop. I'll do. Where is this place? Ah, uh, we're getting closer to it. Hey, Arden. Yeah? When you were talking to Kinua, you mentioned the name Wolfarth. Is that because he also carried the title of Ismir? Yes. And it's also the name... F the, the, uh... The Nordic name for Talos. And I'm not entirely sure how any and all of that works. It's like Shore and Sheza. Shore, Sheza, Lorgan. Same god, different names as far as I'm concerned. That's pretty much how I've always seen it too. I just don't know how the names got different. That'll be it. And how exactly does all this relate to Kinua? That is the part that may well get me killed if I say it out loud. It's not the kind of thing that mortals should know about. Frankly, this is the first time... Wow, alright, that's dark. 
This is the first time in all my years as a scholar that I've been genuinely terrified by something that I've learned. Scrolls testing you, maybe? Ah, uh, probably. With any luck, I've not been found wanting in that regard. Based on your conversation with Dexian, I'd say we've done so far so good. For what it's worth, I know what it's like to keep dangerous secrets. I'd say you're handling this pretty well. Haven't turned into a raving madman yet. Heh, <laughs> yet. <sighs> you mean like... Like... Divine secrets? Or like... High Council type secrets? I speak to Mafala and Hersene and they both answer me. Oh, hold on. Hold that thought. Hold that thought. I think there's spiders down there. So? Could you do me a favor? Uh, y yes. What do you want me to do? Ah, uh, well, you see. I, I don't really do spiders. I've got them. This won't end well for you. Are there any more? Yeah. Probably, given the amount of webs in here. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, Mara, 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 Mara. We're not going that way. No, sir. No, sir. We're going over here. Oh, gods. I hate spiders so much. This is a rickety bridge. Okay. Don't look down. A Falmer excavation site. Pardon me while I... I'm not as familiar with the Falmer as I am with the Aliads. You studied the Aliads. Yeah, I was... <laughs> accidentally something of a specialist on the topic. They didn't have any, uh, uh... A language specialist in my unit, so I just sort of filled in. Interesting. I know a thing or two about them as well. Huh. Oh. Alright then. Maybe we can share notes sometime. Oh! What? Man. What? <laughs> you blend in quite well down here. Um, so that's fun. Any ideas how we're gonna get back up? None whatsoever. I suspect we're gonna have to go through. <sighs> okay. Oh, Mara. <gasps> nope, 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 nope. After you. Who's there? Show yourself. Hey, yikes. Oh, this one by me. No, 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 no. Serana. No. Serana, do you have to resurrect the spiders? Ugh. Arden, are you scared of spiders? Yeah, maybe a little. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm I'm actually terrified of spiders. Fun fact. Um, oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Hi. <laughs> 
Oh god. Oh, I do not like this. Oh, I do not like this one bit. Just breathe on. It's gonna be fine. You say that, but, um, we're probably surrounded by creepy things with eight legs and lots of fuzzy, gross, chitinous... Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, okay. Ooh. <laughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. That was... I'm fine. What? These people were... Why would anyone want to set up camp here? That's an excellent question, Serana. I wonder what happened to them. Well, they died, for sure. One of them's got a note. Good, I get to read something. That will help me calm down, I hope. Sister, I know that you'll come find me, but it will be too late. If you find this letter, get out of this forsaken cave as soon as possible. We were fools to think we would- we could, boy, live so close to such creatures and live peacefully. I should have headed back to camp with you after we placed the torches down here. I thought these troll- oh, there's trolls down here. That's fine. These trolls would be different, that they would somehow understand that we didn't want to hurt them. I'm now cornered, and it's only a matter of, that a matter of time before one of the trolls decides to finish me off. I hope it's a quick death. Oh. Yikes. Something tells me it wasn't a quick death if there were trolls involved. <laughs> Does anybody need a cure disease potion? You're kidding, right? I'm absolutely kidding. Eesh. Trolls, huh? Uh, I will take this. Oh, resist fire. That's a good idea. They're not gonna need any of this anymore. Troll skull! I may actually be able to make an enchanting setup with that. Really? E well, in theory? In practice, I don't actually have a clue. Oh! How you tempt me! You absolute tease of a cave. Are you grinning under that mask? Maybe a little. I'm glad you find pleasure in my misery, Cayman. You can probably use my real name down here. I don't think anyone's likely to overhear. True. Um, hello! That was probably a dumb move. Everybody okay? Yes, just, um, don't do that next time. Mm-hmm, not triggering the, uh, deadfall I.I. captain. Watch your feet. <laughs> Stand up, save me. Mm-hmm. That's knocked over, and it smells like trolls. We must be getting close. Excellent. Close to what? I'm not sure. It smells like something else down here, too. I'm not entirely sure what. And I'm not sure if you can smell it either. Ah! Unfortunately, my nose is not that sensitive, and I can't smell over the trolls. Hold that thought. I'm not casting past anybody. Oh, wow. Alright. Well.
missed again. Let's just go get them. I got one stealth kill. And I am proud of you for it. Would you just die already? Good grief. There's a person down here. What? There's a person down here. Altma? Doesn't smell like an Altma. What exactly does an Altma smell like, anyway? Never mind, don't answer that. I... I'm not gonna answer that either. <laughs> no. What? What's that? I can feel some kind of power from it. No kidding. Um. Hi! Okay. What in oblivion is going on there? What in oblivion is going on with your eyes right now? I'm... Uh, don't worry about it. I... I kind of... Would you... Stop. There we go. Uh, I learned how to do a thing. Come forward. You have nothing to fear here. Uh-huh. That's a... That's a symbol of... Oriel. Ha, uh, hello? I am Knight Paladin Gelibor. Welcome to the Great Chantry of Oriel. This cave is a temple to Oriel. Interesting. Oriel, Oriel, Halkosh, Akatosh, so many different names for the Sovereign of the Snow Elves. Snow Elf, you're a Falmer? I prefer Snow Elf. The name Falmer usually holds a negative meaning to most travelers. Those twisted creatures you call Falmer, I call the Betrayed. Excuse me while I pick my jaw up off the ground. I imagine you know why we're here, considering this is a Chantry of Oriel. Of course. You're here for Oriel's bow. Why else would you be here? I can help you get it. But first, I must have your assistance. Uh, uh okay. What type of assistance? I need you to kill Archcurate Vertha, my brother. There are two. There are two! Okay! My world has come crumbling down and rebuilt itself in spectacular fashion. Why would you like us to kill your brother? The kinship between us is gone. I don't understand what he's become, but he's no longer the brother I once knew. It was the betrayed. They did something to him. I just don't know why Oriel would allow this to happen. What exactly did they do? They swept into the Chantry without warning, and began killing everyone without pause. Did you fight back at all? The Chantry was a place of peaceful worship. I led a small group of paladins, but we were no match for the Betrayed's sheer numbers. They slaughtered everyone, and stormed the Inner Sanctum, where I believe they corrupted Vertha. So you don't even know if he's alive? He's alive. I've seen him, and something's wrong. He never looks as though he's in pain or under duress. He just stands there and watches, as though waiting. Have you tried getting into the Inner Sanctum? Leaving the Way Shrines unguarded would be violating my sacred duty as a Knight Paladin of Oriel, and an assault on the Betrayed guarding the Inner Sanctum would only end with my death. Way Shrine? I assume that's this thing over here. Yes. Let me show you. Okay. Bloody hell, do you know how ancient this man has to be? Well, if he's a snow elf untainted by the Dwemer, I would assume... At least 4,000. So this is snow elf magic. Incredible. This oh, structure Mara. is known as a way shrine. 
They were used for meditation and for transport when the Chantry was a place of enlightenment. Prelates of these shrines were charged with teaching the mantras of Oriel to our initiates. What's that basin in the center signify? Once the initiate completed his mantras, he'd dip a ceremonial ewer in the basin at the Way Shrine center and proceed to the next Way Shrine. So these initiates had to lug around a heavy pitcher of water. Marvelous. How long would they have to do that? Well, once the initiate's enlightenment was complete, he'd bring the ewer to the Chantry's inner sanctum. Pouring the contents of the ewer into the sacred basin of the sanctum would allow him to enter for an audience with the arch curate himself. All that just to end up dumping it out? It makes no sense to me. It's symbolic. I don't expect you to understand. So, let's get this straight. We need to do all that nonsense to get into the temples so we can kill your brother and claim our as well. I know how it all sounds. But if there was another way, I'd have done it long ago. The only way to get to my brother is by following in the Initiate's footsteps and traveling from Way Shrine to Way Shrine, just as they did. The first lay at the end of Darkfall Passage, a cavern that represents the absence of enlightenment. Uh, yeah. Absence of light? Absence of enlightenment? I can see it. How many more way shrines are there? There are five in total, spread far apart across the Chantry. These caves must be massive in that case. Caves? Oh no. The Chantry encompasses far more than a few caves, as you'll soon discover. But before I send you on your way, you'll need the Initiate's Ewer. So I fill this up at each way shrine, correct? Once you've located a way shrine, there'll be a spectral prelate tending to it. They will allow you to draw the waters from the shrine's basin, as if you've been enlightened. Of course. I'll be off then. This may be the last time we're able to converse. If you have any questions before you leave, I suggest you ask them. Otherwise, all I can do now is grant you my hopes for a safe journey. Uh... Do, do you... do you mind if I ask him a few questions? I can see the curiosity burning in you. Go right ahead. Yeah, um... Questions? I expected as much. You... S S Snow Elf. Um... I have studied... Um, a few of the earlier elfin peoples a little bit. I have never been able to ask somebody like you just who exactly were you, you and your people? We were once a wealthy and prosperous society that occupied a portion of Skyrim. Unfortunately, we were constantly at war with the Nords, who claimed the land as their ancestral home. Uh, it appears the Nords won. Night of Tears and all that. In a manner of speaking. We had always maintained an uneasy alliance with the underground dwelling dwarves. And when faced with extinction, we turned to them for help. Surprisingly, they agreed to protect us. But demanded a terrible price. The blinding of our race. Everyone couldn't have possibly agreed to that, right? There were splinter groups that resisted the agreement, and even some that sought alternate alliances. But when it was all said and done, those elves were either slaughtered, vanished, or gave up and took the dwarves' bargain. And what turned your people into the betrayed? I've often asked myself that very same question. The blinding of my race was supposedly accomplished with a toxin, certainly not enough to devolve them into the sad and twisted beings they've become. Why weren't the Snow Elves here afflicted? The Chantry is quite isolated, so it took some time for word of the Dwarves' offer to reach us here. By the time the compact had been completed, it was too late for us to even attempt to intervene. And that's why you retained your sight? Correct. We only numbered perhaps a hundred at the time, so our presence remained a secret to the Dwarves and the Nords. Ironically, our undoing came at the hands of our own people. You mean the Betrayed? Yes. They swarmed the Chantry in vast numbers until we were completely overrun. We never really stood a chance. I assumed that the Arch Curate was corrupted by them when they found a way to breach the Inner Sanctum. Are there others here like you? 
Vertha and myself are the only two snow elves that remain. Jeez. Ah, uh, okay. May Oriel light your path. Yep, I I think I've held us up long enough, huh? Shall we? We shall. After you. Thank you for uh, humoring me. Okay. Oh boy. That wasn't as unpleasant as I thought it would be. Kind of soothing, actually. I feel a little warmer now. Hey, speaking of feeling a little warmer, Arden, you're looking a little paler. You should probably drink something. Are, are you going to be like this the entire journey? Yes. I don't need you collapsing on me at any point. Yeah, 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 you're fine. What? Hmm, okay, we have officially entered territory with which I am completely unfamiliar. What? This is... Huh. Oh, God, that's cold. <gasps> oh, I know what that is. Nope, 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 nope. The only thing that I hate was... That'll teach you. ...than spiders is Taurus, as it turns out. I'm gonna guess... Yuck. That this cave is full of them. Lovely. I probably shouldn't be making much noise. What? What is this? Uh, are either of you seeing this? Seeing what? It's a rock. Oh, okay. Where'd you come from? Ooh, you're getting better at this. I am up to my waist in freezing water. But yes, I suppose I am. I have to admit, though, it's a little bit interesting trying to, um... Hmm. <laughs> trying to maneuver myself when time is kind of sticky like that. Yuck. No. Oh, that's your skeleton. Done and done. Yikes. That's a tall skeleton. Oh. Uh, that must be... That must be a snow elf skeleton in that case. Lovely. I can't believe it. He's the last... There... Ooh. He and his brother, what, Vertha, was it? Are the last two of their kind and he's asking me to kill the other one. Hello. No, you will not touch him. 
I didn't realize you were so protective of me, Lady Serana. <laughs> Neither did I. Please, for the love of Mara, let none of these things burst open. Uh oh, there's more of them. Ew. Looks like these Falmer are here to stay. They must be who that priest was calling the betrayed. No ship. That's usually my line. What have you got? Have we got more? We've got more, don't we? Great! Oh yes! That's a bad idea. Fireball! Sorry. Oh! What are these things? Huh. So you're from Valenwood, right? Yes, I am, as a matter of fact. Have you ever seen plant matter like this before? Never in my life. Oh, good. That's, that's, that's good. Interesting. Huh. Here we go. Oh, poison. Good. I was distracted by the little things. The, the, the... Whatever they are. I was talking to Kidua about them when we were both down in Blackreach. Yes, um, we were both down in Blackreach. And I didn't know... how to describe them at the time. But the... gods, Serana, your necromancy terrifies me. They're little, um... Totem things, whatever they are, markers. They kind of look like. That looks like a giant Falmer up. Not Falmer, Chorus. Ew. I was going Die. to say they look like. Oh, come on. Let me finish a thought, dammit. Anybody else? I'm sure as soon as I do that we're gonna get ambushed again, but whatever. I was going to say they look like... Uh, oh gods. Like... A mockery? of the symbol of Oriel, or perhaps the symbol of Akatosh. A little creepy, don't you think? I don't see it myself, but I'll take your word for it. There we go. You're uh, pretty handy with your hands. Wow. I could have done better than that. <laughs> I've I've heard and said far worse, don't worry about it. 
They do. Look at that. They look like... Ha! <laughs> they either look like, um, shrine... Like, corrupted shrines to Oriel. Or I'm completely lost. Or, like, maybe devotions to Hermaeus Mora or something. Hermaeus Mora. Daedric Prince of all sorts of fun things. Mm-hmm. What in oblivion is going on here? I don't want to know. No, I don't. Oh, no, you don't. Oh. Hold it. And that is a giant deposit of Ethereum. Okay. I'm thinking I hear Falmer. I don't. I'll let you do the honors. Hello. Everyone stand back. I'll do. Do you, do you need a hand? No. That'll teach you. Yikes! It snuck up on me. And that's why we keep our guards up. Indeed. What? What even is that thing? Also, it, it kind of beggars the mind, but nice. But it seems the Falmer, the betrayed Falmer, have some kind of crude architecture. Interesting. I... I wish I knew more about Falma architecture pre all the badness. Ooh. After all that fire magic, that actually felt really good. Oh. Well. I hope I didn't just... Um, hey guys, I'm up here. Okay. Eh, he'll find his way eventually. Of course. Oh! Well, I'm glad I triggered it, since I'm the one in the heavy armor. Nope! Damn bugs.
Okay, and this is where I kind of screwed up. Oh, more spider webs. Oh, please no. Fair point. Good observation. Okay. Hi, kitty. For you. Oh. There you are. And I've never seen a cat like that before, lest you wanted to ask. Uh... Nope. I was not gonna ask. That's... Uh... Oh. Hey, Black Reach Part 2. Here we go. Oh good, I see the thing. The thing. <laughs> oh, hey, careful on that thing. It's got some kind of gas. It's got some kind of gas. <laughs> and there's Ethereum everywhere in here. What is this place? I feel like I'm not even in Tamriel anymore. What kind of deer are you? Huh. Okay, something over here. Yes? No? Ah, uh, one of those poison bloom things. Good thing we seem to be immune to them. Huh! Another cat! <laughs> so, uh, green pack is just plants, right? Pretty much. Does that include fungi? Fungi? Whatever? You know, I've never actually thought about that. They're actually not, but... I, I don't know what counts for that kind of thing, so, um, after you. Mr. Deer. I think that's another way shrine up there. Here we go. Yep, that is definitely a way shrine. Hello. Welcome, Initiate. This is the way shrine of illumination. Are you prepared to honor the mantras of Ariel and fill your vessel with his enlightenment? Depends on the mantras of Auriel, but yes. Then behold Auriel's gift, my child. May it light your path as you seek tranquility within the inner sanctum. <laughs> tranquility, huh? Oh. Well. Uh, all right, thank you. Where do we go from here? Through the door would be my guess. 
Everyone with me? Eh, more or less. Oh, that's... Interesting. Must be daylight out. But we're not in a cave anymore, so that's nice. I mean, we're still in a cave, but I can... Daylight somewhere. This isn't new. This is a different kind of stone. I would almost think it's volcanic in nature, but it's not quite. I'm about to be blinded, I feel. Ooh, yep. Uh, oh. Alright. How daylight is it? Daylight enough that I can't see for crap. Okay. It's snowing. This is incredible. It's like a whole other world. Come on, the bow has to be in this valley somewhere. I wish I could see more of it. I almost said alien ruins, but no, the Falmer ruins everywhere. I can't even tell what time it is, the fog is too dense. Hello! That'll teach you. Thank you, Cayman. Yeah, I think we're safely out of the someone's gonna overhear territory. Yeah, that's probably fair. So what do you say, do we camp out here and continue, or do we just continue? It's foggy enough, we might as well just continue. Hmm. Let's, uh... Let's take a rest for just a bit, shall we? I'll get refueled in wrath, and we'll continue on from there. Alright, sounds fine to me.